Hi, I'm Kathleen Hudson. Welcome to a demonstration on painting waterfalls. We'll be looking at creating dynamic value compositions for your waterfall paintings. I will show you from start to finish how to create that compelling composition and how to use your opaque and transparent pigments with each other in a way that they relate and, and create a highlight that is luminous. Oftentimes when students approach a subject like waterfalls, they focus on the bigger picture. For the most part, waterfall paintings will be more compelling if the artist zooms in on the subject matter. And instead of locating the waterfall within a larger painting, if you zoom in, you can look at the moving water, you can look at the reflective surfaces of wet rocks. It makes for a more compelling painting. The way that I approach painting in general and waterfalls specifically is a multi-step process that can help students get set up for their best chance of success in a painting. And that's because I break things down into stages. I start by looking at value. I do a transparent underpainting after doing my preparatory work. And then I move on to blocking in some color. Um, I pre-mix all of my colors and I'll show you how to do that. And what this does is it gives me a chance to isolate my decision making. When you're painting, you are going through so many decisions at the same time. You're thinking about your values, you're thinking about composition, you're thinking about line, you're thinking about color, um, you're also thinking about edges and texture. And those are a lot of things to consider all at once. So I try to isolate those decisions into different steps. And doing so will enable you to make better decisions at each stage of the process. And then it also enables you to be more confident in your brushwork. So as you are applying thicker paint towards the end of your painting process, you can do that with confidence. I really want to encourage students to use that tactile, textural feel of oil paint and be bold with their brushwork. That will amplify the subject matter of waterfalls, especially because you can use your brushwork to indicate motion, to make the waterfall feel dynamic and so oil paint is uniquely suited to that subject. Let's paint this waterfall together and in a way that leaves you inspired to go out, tackle the same subject with confidence and know that you'll come up with a design that you're excited about and then paint more gesturally. Paint with boldness so that you can capture the movement of water.